this here is uh we're working on this chevy here we're gonna do a new headliner in it today shout out to my boy aiden this is gonna be his first truck Pulling out all this plastic trim and getting the actual headliner out. All right, so here we are. Got the headliner out of the truck. All right, here's so what we're going to end up doing pulling all this cloth off and get going ahead and clean up all of the foam that came off underneath the cloth and get it ready to put the new headliner on. Now we're gonna have to go ahead and scrape all this foam off the fiberglass. And I'm doing this, I'm using a little stainless steel brush. That seems to be what's working good. But uh, we might have to go get us a bigger brush because it sucks. I just don't have any that, uh, that are clean enough. It'll be a trip to Harbor Freight to go get us something. So that's a pretty clean looking headliner, ain't it? Badass. But we got some fiberglass repair we really got to do on this, especially around these edges. You know, otherwise, this cloth really isn't going to work. And I mean, from a composite's working with this point of view, the one thing we know, we can't use uh, fiberglass resin. The fiberglass resin will eat the foam. And that's all this is backed with is foam. So I have some, uh, you know, because I do quite a bit of marine stuff and do some composites repair too. Um, I have some uh, some pro marine. Come check this out. Come look at it, dude. It's probably exactly what it is. Tap plastics. Four to one marine grade epoxy right so this is what we're going to lay that back up with and repair it with because we know we need to get epoxy and this is just the the exact right epoxy we need to do that with Got my dad down here hanging out with me today. Check this out. We got all this resin dried on the edge of this so we can here. I'll show you the repair. So all this is a little bit darker. This is where I repaired this headliner using that epoxy. Right, and that's the tap green grade epoxy just just the right tool for this job to really get this done and get it done the way it should be so this is good and stiff and will last just as long as it did before it went last time yeah i'm stoked on this i'm really stoked on how well this turned out now that we got all the glass work prepared we'll actually start putting the the new fabric on here using the glue that they sold me with the fabric. They told me it's pretty good.
forward. Here we are, halfway through. We ran out of glue. We gotta go get glue. Let's go get glue. Dude. Let you guys do your assembly and disassembly. Being a crew cap Chevy, it's pretty entertaining trying to get it all back together, but we'll get her. We'll make it nice. Turn out good. All right, so here we are. Check out this headliner. Come out really sweet. I'm super stoked on it. This is the end result here. Absolutely beautiful headliner. Nice looking Chevy truck, Snow 5, 2500. Crew cab. I think it turned out really well. Tell me what you guys think down in the comments. Uh, if you like the general gearhead stuff, just keep following me and we'll keep going at it and that'll be good. I, uh, I like the subscriptions. I like uh, I like it when you guys like me. So if you would, go ahead, like, and subscribe. We're going to go ahead and start fixing some headlight buckets up here because hers are shot. And uh, get on out of your hair.